when you pay the bounty off right they will remember just because you paid your bounty off doesn't mean nothing they will remember you when you come back you see this <laughs> lost your way country man <laughs> looking for the cheapest whore house <laughs> as if he even likes ladies <laughs> This is a setup. This is a setup. I don't even know why I'm chasing them. Or I don't start move. shooting. Let's get those hands up nice and high. <laughs> Works every time. <laughs> Hold on. I knew it was a setup. I knew it was a setup. Pick again. I knew it was a setup, but I couldn't just let him rob me like that. Wanted Arthur Morgan is wanted now. I'm wanted. I'm you see what happened? They set me up. And now I'm wanted. Bitch. I couldn't hit him. Now you did, you hear me? I get set up and this happens. Oh my god. You see? Push in on him. Come on through horse. Oh my god, I'm stuck. I'm surrounded! Get off me! You see what I mean? You can't do this. Drive the train. See, they don't know I was defending myself. That's the thing. Oh, shit. See, the thing is, they don't know that I was defending myself. All they know is I'm over here killing people. They heard the gunshots. They came around there. Hurry up, horse. This is some BS, dog. I knew that's gonna happen. No! I can't even use it anymore. Can I steal this boat though? 
I'm about to dry him. I like it too, baby. Let's get some supper. Oh, say whatever you damn well please, but I tell you, if I don't get out of here soon, I'm gonna kill somebody. And if you don't stop hissing at me, I'm gonna kill you. You come near me, sailor, and I'll slice you up. You put that knife down, or you could be missing a hand. Lady. What is wrong with you two? I ain't chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. <sighs> My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner! Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife! <laughs> Enough! Both of you! Well, come with me, then. You want to head out there? Run with the man? So be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, so well, they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Good. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Mrs. Zad are gonna take a little ride. Yeah, sure. Here's my list, and can you post this letter for me while you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. Are you coming with me then, woman? I was not trying to do this. So I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. I was trying to talk to Molly. Yep. Never gonna get there at this place. I, I was trying to talk to Molly. You cool down then yet? I guess. No, I ain't no scullion. And I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweat and half wit. I guess we all got to do our share, princess. <laughs> and I didn't get to eat either. I was trying to eat. I was trying to eat. And I was trying to uh, talk to Molly. I didn't either one. Where's that letter? Oh, are you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. <clears throat> Here. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy. You are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time. So I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> you ever actually even talk to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look, we're all hiding behind something. <laughs> and what's this? Return to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Now that's Dutch's idea. All mail to be sent to the same age. Whenever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. <laughs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. Well, how's it holding? I mean, we really out here just going to get some groceries. Okay, here we are. So, what's the plan? I shoot the shopkeeper while you. No, are you insane? Well, I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws, not, not idiots. idiots. We rob fools and rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy some food to eat. 
No guns. For sure. This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. This girl is crazy. This girl is crazy. She's really crazy. I'm the law girl. Nothing. What do you mean? Can I help you, mister? Yes, I would like to post a letter. All right. Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Bye now. Burns bold with more strength than you. Hell, my sister's newborn had more strength than you, and he came out bright blue. I'm trying. Try harder. Hold on, she wasn't. She wasn't dressed like this. What happened? I think this is everything. Thanks. Here. Take that for yourself, okay? Oh, that ain't. Thanks. Well, give it back then. Jesus. Is there strip clubs? I didn't ask for goddamn help. Probably something like that. Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady, get a move on. She, we, we match it now? She trying to match me? Not lady. I know. So, you get everything? I think so. And some new clothes, I see? Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair making cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you, uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and no. Nobody's taking nothing for Lady has asked for a harmonica. Find Sadie or harmonica. All right. Ever again. Mm -hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Hey there. Hey. What uh? What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in the Morn Raider country. Keep it cool. Steve. You need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Ah! Go, go, go! God damn it! This girl. Get me now! This girl really just did that? They was gonna rob us. Was, but not anymore. Think you're landing rickets. Oh, I'm gonna run. Oh, that's a boy. Why you run the boy over? You ain't got a chance. Well, wanted to see some action. Where you okay, girl? Okay. You okay there, Sadie? I mean, you wanted this. You wanted this. Now, now we got it. Let's die. Killer, same as any man. Hold on, I'll handle this. I'll handle him. Come here. Come here. I don't know what her little. I don't know what her problem is. Oh, no, I need to eat. There, see? Not many still standing now. Because of me. Stay down. 
Just stay down. Oh, ain't no running. She wanted that so badly. She wanted that so badly. I appreciate the subscription, El Cocaineo. Are you thinking about the loot? What you mean, girl? What are you doing? We should get out of here. Nah. We don't kill and not loot. But she right though. We should we should get out of here. Your boy needs to eat. No. I would have loved to grow up in that time period. I don't Why? think so. Because you've caused enough trouble already. I'm fine. Hey, you want me to drive? We showed those bastards, huh? Remind me not to get on your bad side. And they was clearly planning to bushwhack us. You did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe. If he asked. But maybe not. You know what? So who did they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, I've run into them before. Some local gang. Don't seem to have grown out of playing soldiers. Anyway, will not you go upset and piercing about that letter? How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. I won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind of follows. You didn't get yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I, I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe, <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but... I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice pants, by the way. Oh, shut up. And I still need to eat. 